song Haikyo, Hyun Bin and Sun Yi Jin, the memorable moments of their hearts. Hyun Bin and Song Haikyo and Sun Yi Jin were once a fantastic couple, and there's a sudden detail that has resurfaced, which once earned them a perfect 10 when they did this together. Today, let's explore this detail and learn more about this couple. On the occasion of the 15th anniversary of the world that they live in, a fascinating story about the film has been shared. It is known that this project played a part in bringing Hyun Bin and Song Haikyo together as a couple. They publicly announced their relationship after the film ended, causing a sensation in the entertainment industry. It is worth noting that both actors simultaneously waived their fees for this film, an action that received a perfect 10 from the public. The world that they live in falls into the genres of romance and drama, with Hyun Bin and Song Haikyo in the leading roles. When the film was released in 2008, they surprised the audience with their explosive on-screen chemistry, looking just like a real-life couple. Hyun Bin Won shared that the film had many kissing scenes, which made him and his co-star inevitably feel a bit embarrassed. However, later on, the performances of these two A-list stars couldn't salvage a lackluster script like the world that they live in. The film hit rock bottom in terms of ratings and was considered one of the forgettable projects in the careers of Song Haikyo and Hyun Bin. It is known that the two stars did not receive their agreed-upon fees on time as per the initial agreement. It wasn't until 2014 when the Korean media reported that the couple had agreed to waive their fees for the film's production team. The reason behind this decision was that both Hyun Bin and Song Haikyo wanted to help the production team overcome a financial crisis. This action by the couple received praise from the audience and the press. Fifteen years have passed since the release of The World That They Live In, and Hyun Bin and Song Haikyo have not had the opportunity to reunite on screen. Currently, Hyun Bin is actively involved in the film industry and spends a lot of time taking care of his firstborn son with Sun Yu Jin. On the other hand, Song Haikyo is making a strong comeback in the television industry and enjoying her single life at the age of 41. Falling in love with Hyun Bin and the striking similarities between Song Haikyo and Sun Yu Jin. Song Haikyo and Sun Yu Jin have always been among the most captivating names in the Korean entertainment industry. These two beauties share many similarities, with one especially remarkable connection, both fell in love with the actor Hyun Bin after working together on a project. Falling in love with Hyun Bin after a project together. In 2008, Hyun Bin and Song Haikyo collaborated in the drama Worlds Within, also known as The World That They Live In. The drama aired in late 2008, sparking rumors about a romantic relationship between the two lead actors. The World That They Live In was filled with kissing scenes and intense on-screen chemistry between Song Haikyo and Hyun Bin. In August 2009, the two celebrated Korean actors officially confirmed their relationship. In the promotional photos for the world that they live in, Hyun Bin always cast affectionate glances at Song Haikyo. The Korean media commented, We've never seen him look at anyone like that before. Later, when Hyun Bin was rumored to be dating Sun Yi Jin, Korean media and public opinion suggested, Hyun Bin is looking at Sun Yi Jin in the same way he looked at Song Haikyo. Their love story unfolded quickly and came to an end when Hyun Bin enlisted for his military service. Many sources shared that, upon enlisting, Hyun Bin sent a message to Song Haikyo, saying, I'm sorry for making you wait. Nearly a decade later, Hyun Bin paired up with Sun Yi Jin in the drama Crash Landing on You. Their sweet interactions on screen immediately caused a sensation. Their dating rooms made headlines, and Dispatch released photos of their dates in early 2021. Both achieved fame with the Four Seasons series. The Hallow wave began to flourish, spreading Korean culture throughout Asia with the Four Seasons series, Spring Waltz, Autumn in My Heart, Summer Scent, and Winter Sonata. Interestingly, Song Haikyo and Sun Yi Jin were the two female leads in the series. Song Haikyo gained international fame with Autumn in My Heart, while Sun Yi Jin rose to stardom with Summer Scent. What's even more intriguing is that both actresses appeared in two different dramas within this series but they were paired with the same male lead, Song Soon Hun, who played the main male character in both series. Song Soon Hun was the only male actor to appear in two dramas from the Four Seasons series. After Autumn in My Heart, 
Many sources suggested that Song Soon Hun and Song Hai Kyo spent time getting to know each other. In both dramas from the Four Seasons series and during the early stages of their careers, Song Hai Kyo and Sun Yi Jin aimed to build a pure and innocent image. This was another commonality between them. From innocent image to bold intimate scenes. Song Hai Kyo and Sun Yi Jin are often considered as natural beauties in the Korean entertainment industry. While many Korean actresses resort to cosmetic surgery and enhancements, Song Hai Kyo and Sun Yi Jin are known for their natural beauty and are hailed as the top beauties of the entertainment industry in Korea. With their natural beauty, Song Hai Kyo and Sun Yi Jin initially embraced an innocent image in their careers. After a long period of establishing themselves as pure and innocent young women, both actresses decided to break away from this image. They agreed to take on projects that involved bold intimate scenes to make a significant change in their careers. Sun Yi Jin became known as the queen of intimate scenes after starring in films like April Snow and White Knight, where she agreed to disrobe and perform explicit scenes. Song Hai Kyo, on the other hand, took it a step further by participating in an adult-themed film that was banned in South Korea for its explicit content, titled Fetish. After their attempts to shed their innocent image and venture into bolder roles didn't yield the expected success, both Song Hai Kyo and Sun Yu Jin returned to their pure and innocent image. However, Sun Yu Jin received praise for her acting maturity, while Song Hai Kyo faced criticism for her one-dimensional acting and stiffness. Sun Yi Jin and Hai and Bin's 2020 project, Crash Landing on You, set a record in terms of ratings. On the other hand, Song Hai Kyo's highest rated project was Descendants of the Sun, which aired in 2016. In 2021, Song Hai Kyo made a return with Now We Are Breaking Up, a project that received criticism for being a new low in the career of the screen goddess, both in terms of acting and ratings. Sun Yi Jin is currently starring in 39, a drama that has been criticized for being dull, lackluster, and with low ratings. Another striking similarity between the two beauties of the entertainment industry is that they both married their co-stars after a project. Song Hai Kyo married Song Joon Ki after Descendants of the Sun, and Sun Yi Jin will marry Hai and Bin on 30 March, 2023, after working together on Crash Landing on You. Both dramas caused a sensation, with Hai and Bin and Song Joon Ki leaving a significant impact with their military roles. In summary, the story of Hai and Bin and Song Hai Kyo's relationship, their on screen chemistry, and their shared journey in the entertainment industry reflect the complexities of fame and personal lives. The couple's decision to waive their fees for the film The World That They Live In demonstrated their commitment to the project and their willingness to support the production team. While they have moved on to pursue individual careers and personal lives, the memories of their time together on and off screen continue to captivate fans and spark interest in the world of Korean entertainment. Additionally, the striking similarities between Song Hai Kyo and Sun Yi Jin, from their shared experiences in the Four Seasons series to their transitions from an innocent image to daring intimate scenes, provide an intriguing perspective on their careers. Both actresses have made bold choices to break away from their established personas, with varying degrees of success. Their respective marriages to co-stars further add to the fascination surrounding their lives and careers in the ever-evolving world of Korean entertainment.